So this is the Motorola Razr I, the brand new addition to the Razr family. What is great is we've got this 4.3 inch screen, but now it's really pocketable. So we've effectively taken away all the borders. Yeah, so as you can see, it's an edge-to-edge -edge display, but really has taken up just over 70% of the overall surface area of the phone. Okay, what we have is some premium material. So we have aluminum grade around the sides. We have Kevlar, DuPont Kevlar on the back, which allows protection. And also on the front, we have Corning Gorilla Glass, which allows it to be very durable for scratch. Um, and those sort of aspects of the day. What we have here is we have the Intel processor complementing the actual speed of this handset. So as you can see here, flipping from screen to screen, multitasking becomes a breeze. Yeah. To complement that, it's all about general performance. So we have a camera, which is 8 megapixels, but with the Intel processor, it launches within a second straight from the screen off. Allows you to do multi-shot mode, so up to 10 shots in under a second, giving you those great pictures and really quick response time. We have a very great battery life, with 2,000 milliamp battery included, and you can see here, all your battery kind of widgets can actually keep you up to date with that. What is brilliant is we have the Smart Actions app, which also allows you to customize everything that you do on your phone so it's really easy to run. We have a Google Android 4.0 ice cream sandwich giving you the best of the Google Play Store. 600,000 apps you have access to. And we have a few additions as well with our software. A quick swipe to the left gives you all of your quick settings. And also the circle widget, which has become very addictive, allows you to get your updates for your texting, your emails, and also gives you the weather and your battery settings directly on the screen. So the full screen phone has really come to life with the Razer Eye, um, available on many networks um, in the UK and Latin America.